Check one, two. Everything's sounding okay? chopper <laughs> i'm feeling like all sorts of crap but that's okay the raid has started incoming i've had the cold and flu for oh, about four days five days but i'm pumped up full of cold and flu tablets i have a coffee and a big canister of water sorry i'm not doing shots tonight guys but we're gonna have a great night this is for amazing charity we've been doing this for ooh, four years now i think Three or four, but it's been going for about five. It is an amazing cause. It's called Zine Fest. 
This is the last set of day two. So you consider it in Australia, it's a Sunday afternoon, so it could technically be the start of day three or the end of day two, whatever your flavour. Ah, we're going to start off nice and deep. I'll wait till the raid arrives. Oh, here it comes. Welcome, Raiders. Can I just say an absolute man up to Meta Pattern, who played the last two hours? Dude, I, I can't do any of the things that you did. Um, insane Rubik's Cubes, insane mixing, great song choice, and drum and bass. But I can play music and push buttons. So, hard act to follow, I know. But please, if you don't, haven't given him a follow, please give him a follow. Thank you so much, Abraham. Also, big thanks to the ones that played before. Uh, Co-founder of Zingfest, Miss Patchett. Back on the decks after a good long while. So thank you so much for doing that. And of course, more for then, the Rabbits. My man from Chicago. We're going around the world. Make yourself at home, grab a drink. I'll harass you later to donate. Here we go. But the donut bar's going up. I'm not sure who contributed, but thank you so much. You might have to shout out for me. I'll also make sure that I update the dono list. Be a good boy. And meta pattern that match dollar for dollar. Dude, amazing. Thank you so much. Let's see where the donut bar takes us. I'd be totally happy to match dollar for dollar from now, if you like. I've donated 160, so for those out there, I'm looking at you Aussies because Aussies haven't joined the Steam Fest just yet. Everything you donate from now, above and beyond 160, I'll pop it up so that this will be dollar for dollar.
Oh yeah. Nice work. Let's keep it going. We should probably raise our dono by now, yeah? Oh yeah. Let's keep it going. so much for the compliment on the mug. It's my Omno. And also my Zimfest shirt. If you haven't had a chance to do so, head over to the merch store. I'm not sure, Sense, if you got the link for the merch store? Feel free to buy some uh, Zimfest paraphernalia. Fits nice. Protects my man boobies. And I've done a good part. Now we're going to throw a few kind of conservation facts at you. 
throughout the stream just to kind of get you feeling passionate about giving because all proceeds to Zinefest go towards the World Wildlife Fund. So feel free to either scan the QR code right up there or if you're in Twitch, just do the exclamation point donate and boom, it'll pick up there. And if you're going to new to Twitch or if you're just uh, simulcasting it over on our website, you can also go to a link that I will show you later on. Now, if you're listening to this back on YouTube, I'll put these recordings up there. We're going to leave the donation uh, section open for a few weeks. So if you're watching this back in May or possibly June, you can still donate. Just go to zinefest.info for all the details. Let's go. Favorite Deep House track of the year. Beautiful. Bring back the light. Bring back the light. Bring back the light. 
Dodger's going to hit some, give you some conservation facts. As we know, wildlife preservation is really, really important because everything's linked. So if you think about the food you eat, whatever your diet might be, um, a lot of what ends up on your plate starts somewhere else. And the WWF um, does try to preserve that as much as possible to end uh, illegal and, um, and ravaging forestation. For example, a lot of the uh, forestation that exists in the Amazon is actually the reason why we have krill in the oceans. And if it wasn't for krill, then we wouldn't have wildlife because people eat the krill and then they eat the other animals, and the other fish, and the other sea life. And that's why we have seafood on our plates. So it's all interlinked. And every dollar that you give goes towards an organization. That will help. We continue. Enough deep stuff. Let's play some funky music. Thank you. 
left to right, 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 right, left to right. Are you ready? Interesting fact for you to know, there is definitely an independence on the land and depending on where the land is. So a little known fact to a lot of people is that um, indigenous cultures in Australia have been harvesting the land for 60,000 years and they've been doing it in a very unique way. Um, and one example is what they call uh, coal burning. It basically means that they actually allow <clears throat> the, the, the natural grasses to still grow over the top and it literally burns the undergrowth underneath does not disturb any of the wildlife whatsoever and it only burns away those things that don't belong there and then it allows the native grasses to germinate because the soil in Australia is very unique it's very very light now what happened when the English settlers came over is that they brought cattle and the hooves basically packed that dry earth down and then when the native grasses were pulled up 
basically it turned to desert. And that's kind of where we are today. Again, very, very important that you leave nature to take care of itself. And please give generously to WWF because they help do that. Let's get going. If I could think of all the right things to say, would you hold me to this feel, feeling in the end? If I could think of all the right things to say, would you hold me to this feel, feeling in the end? If I don't We can make amends. All you gotta do is give generous. <laughs> Looks like we're probably $70 into the stream so far. So we've got another $90 to catch up to the 160 that I've already donated. And then anything above and beyond that, I will match more dollar, more dollar. Otherwise, if you donated, good on you. Well done. Give yourself a pat on the back, pour yourself a drink, sit back, relax, and a dance. Beautiful track from the voice of Sinead O'Connor. By the way, any track IDs, right up there. Check them out, buy them. Don't stream them, buy them. Give the artist their dues. Shoot us. 
couldn't come to one of my streams without me getting froggy on you. We'll build it up a notch. We're about 40 minutes in. For those of you unaware, by the way, I probably haven't used myself properly. <laughs> my name is Timmy Johnston. I run a little channel called Timmy Johnston TV, and I go by the moniker of Ampersand. I uh, normally run a show called The Ampersand Show, where I play music, mix, and all that shit. But tonight, it's a very special event. For those who've just tuned in, either on zinefest.info or have just wandered into Twitch channels, hello. This is a special event called Zinefest. Zim is another word for Mother Earth. We want to protect her, and the World Wildlife Fund does just that. So if you'd like to donate, and we would love you to do so, please either scan the QR code up in the corner. There's my bearings up there. Or you can, if you're in the Twitch chat, hit exclamation donate. Give generously. We've had $70 contributed to this particular stream. But if you look down the bottom, holy shitballs. 4,362 moolahs. Amazing. Thank you for all of the dollar dues that have been donated over the last two days. This is the last set of day two. It is a wet, cold, and balmy Australian afternoon. And we're going to continue on. Also, I'm looking at all of my Australian friends because this may be the one time that you actually partake in Zinefest. So now is your time to donate. All right, I'm going to shut the hell up. Play some more music, shall we? legend. By the way, if you haven't given this man a follow, DJ please do. DJ Chopper is very prolific state. and streams amazing music. Is to begin by listening. an oldie but a goodie. Well, then you wish rework anyway. Don't try to identify the sounds you're hearing. Don't put names on them. Simply allow them to play with your eardrum. Don't judge the sounds. 
There are no, as it were, proper sounds or improper sounds. It's all just sound. As you hear sounds coming up in your head, you simply listen to them as part of the general noise going on. And soon you will find that the so-called outside world and the so-called inside world come together, 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 come Overtime. Accept it. Oh, yeah. Bars raised. All right, we've got a new goal. If we hit 4,500, we go into overtime. Yeah. Little uh, verbal agreement between you and me. It's between us friends. Come on. You know you want it. you to listen to the sound of my voice just as if it were noise. Don't try to make any sense out of what I'm saying, because your brain will take care of that automatically. You don't have to try to understand anything. Just listen to the sound. As you hear sounds coming up in your head, you simply listen to them as part of the general noise going on. And soon you will find that the so-called outside world and the so-called inside world come together, come together, come together, come together, come together. They are a happening. And everything is simply a happening. And all you're doing is watching it. That is quite all right, Miss Hatchet. You look after yourself, right? I'm pepped up on drugs too. But we'll just keep going, yeah? And after this, I'll collapse, just like you.
right, let's make it feel good music now. It's going to be cheesy. It's going to be awesome. Also, a quick mention to Escape Velocity, aka SenseNet, who's been helping out DJ Chatchit for many years now three years, four years. Co founders of ZineFest. She's been helping on the mods and also saved my bacon today because I slept in. Whoops. <laughs> and while I'm also talking about people that put this together, a uh, big shout out to Volumetric, aka Dan who's been taking care of the earlier sets and also Save My Bacon <laughs> by modding for me. And of course, Miss Hatcher, thank you once again for putting this all together. It takes a lot of effort, a lot of time, a lot of coordination and a lot of time zones. <laughs> so thank you, thank you, thank you. Much love. If you're not ill or injured, if you're in your lounge chair, get up, get out of your chair, jump around a little bit, get the blood flowing. Let's do this. Scene Fest 2023, here we go.
All right, folks, let's in my bomb. Emotes away, Kappa away. Let's fill this stream with emotion. I love it. I love it. Thank you so much for your contribution there, folks. Let's get going. Let's get funky again, yeah? Bet you do.
And for those who haven't joined the stream recently, you'll find that there is a donation bar right at the bottom, right down there. And you'll find that it hasn't moved in a little while. So if you're new to the chat, you can look if you want, but the most important thing to do is donate. Donate, donate, donate. Exclamation, donate is the command to bring up the link, or you can go to zemefest.info where you can see a stream and also have a link. I will match dollar for dollar. And I'll even go into overtime if we get up to 4,500. I think we can do it. Hopefully there's a few Aussies that are tuning in. It's approximately 3.10 in the afternoon. So hopefully work is done and you're tuning in. And by the way, if you're watching this back on YouTube, we'll leave the donation lines open a little bit longer so you can donate even after the stream is finished. This is officially day two, last set of Zinefest. We've got another day, which will start for Australia in the wee hours of 2 a.m. in the morning. But for those stateside and in Europe, you got one more day left. Save a little for yourself, yeah? Let's do it. Time to get the German fist pumping jar.
Oh, by the way, if anyone's seen Eurovision this weekend? So Australia's part of Eurovision, in case uh, over the people over in the States are wondering, well, how the hell is Australia in the Eurovision contest? We're not really sure, but we embrace it. This year, our act is amazing. <laughs> Everything you'd expect in Eurovision. The band from Perth. And they're absolutely rocking it out. Now, Sense, he plays a guitar. Just saying. Might be worth a watch. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure that, like, I heard that the US decided to make their own song competition. They're like, well, can't be in Eurovision, we'll make our own. <laughs> Not quite as good. But they do bring the cheese, and that's the most important thing. Shout out on toast. Wave your hands in the air, kind of song. Hello to anyone in my workplace that's streaming in from their phones on their break. Hello, how you doing? Sorry, I've made to work for the last couple of days. I am pepped up on cold and flu tablets, and I am just hanging in there. <laughs> but I promise I'll be work back to work on Tuesday. I think I'll be right.
a belter vocal. Such a good voice. I'm so unfit. 
It's all good. Actually, speaking of fitness, if um if you're wondering, um we're going to be wrapping up our streaming duties at the end of the month to take place for me to lose a few kilos on a game called Zwift. And uh, you just kind of ride and you laugh at me while I sweat my pants off. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it's good fun. I'll start that in June. I'll be adding some stuff later on on my regular show, but uh, I'm not going to take up too much of the attention because the most important thing today is to donate. Donate. We haven't seen that donate bar move for a while now. It's making me sad. I don't want to be sad. I want to be happy. For those who haven't donated, please do. For those who have, fucking good on you. You're a bloody little legend. I love Serato Sims. That makes me happy. conservation mention um, if you're uh, a subscriber to Apple TV Plus and I know that not many people are but if you are check out a sci-fi oh there's a sci-fi yeah it's practically sci-fi called extrapolations it's um, got an amazing cast by the way but it really talks about 
fast forward 10 years, 20 years, 40 years, 50 years, and to see wildlife diminish because we didn't do anything. And the one episode that really got me was the very last whale. We were tracking the very last whale. And the very last whale thought there was another whale. And technology could allow one person to communicate with that whale. And the whale couldn't understand the concept of lying. And the lady had to break it to her that the company that paid her basically, that they were lying to you. And that whale sound that she manufactured. Very sad. We can turn this around though. Donate, do what we can. We have to make it a priority. Because if we don't, it's going to end up like that. So please, please do what you can. Just little things. And stand up to those big companies. If they don't have an environmental policy and it's not greenwashing, don't buy it. Vote with your money.
Bayer mood tonight, playing a lot of Bayer. Let's bring it up one more notch. Let's rock it hard before I pass out, yeah? The offer still stands. I'll do it. I will do it. I'll slave for you. I will bleed for you if you make it to 4,500. Now that's all right. I like being mean. Let's look at Mrs. Ampersand. She treats me mean. That's all right. I'll do what I'm told, yeah? <laughs>
Let's rock out. This is a banger. A head banger. Are you ready? Let's rock. Afternoon, Tater. Good to see ya. Have you had a chance to donate to Zine Fest yet? It's not too late. Right down the bottom there. Exclamation point donate. We're wrapping it up very soon. About five minutes to go. We might go over a... Oh, i got a couple more songs I want to play for you.
Last song coming up. Thank you so much for everybody that come on the chat. For those people that came before me, I didn't get to see the first couple of sets, but I did see Mad Rabbits. Well done. After that, of course, Miss DJ Tatchett, the co founder of Zine Fest, coming back to blast us with some techno, techno, techno. Then after that, Meta Pattern. Bro, that was brilliant. And I'm super impressed by your Rubik's Cube. Like, <laughs> it's nuts. Big love to all of my regulars, DJ Chopper, Michelle Flamingo, and me, Sock, he's gone, who also had a banger set and took a lot of shots for the cause. <laughs> oh, well done. We'll play one more. We're back in our regularly scheduled program soon. We've got an indie 90s special coming up very, very soon. And of course, Zine Fest goes into day three tomorrow, Australian time in the wee hours of 2am. Check out the DJs then. Kitty. 